let me ask, did you ever meet Tom Cruise? No, never. <laughs> This is a Cinedy Gear News video, supported by B&H and CVP. Hi, I'm Johnny from Cinedy, and I'm here with Wakamatsu-san from Sigma. Wakamatsu-san, how are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm very well, thank you very much. And this is Interby 2022 here in Tokyo. And let me ask, did you ever meet Tom Cruise? No, never. The reason I'm asking, because you developed a special edition of your Sigma lenses for the Top Gun movie. Tell me a little bit about this. Yes, uh, today we showcase a special lens set uh, that is shoot on Top Gun Maverick. Uh, because in 2018, we received a request from the Top Gun Maverick shooting team uh, to implement eye technology electrical contact and its connection to our existing uh, full-frame uh, high-speed prime series. That's very interesting. So how many sets did you actually develop for the movie? Yes, we made four sets and we sent three sets to Hollywood and we keep kept uh, one set in our headquarter, so then we showcase the last one set. This is, this is really amazing. So you have one just in case or for souvenir? Yes, it's a kind of yeah, heritage to, of our development history. So tell me a little bit how the request came to your headquarter. Yes, first we re received from our Top Gun Maverick team at the Kessel camera to our subsidiary in Sigma uh, Corporation of America. And then the, the message uh, forwarded to our headquarters and we received and uh, known their request at the end. And what is the main difference between this special set and the one that you're selling to people like me? Yes, the different difference of this, these ranges is uh, is the eye technology, electrical contact, and the communication. Because at that time, our primes has no electrical contact of the PL mount. But, you know, EF and the E mount has, has, but at that time, PL has no electrical contact. That is most different point of these lenses. When it comes to optical performance or the housing, this is exactly the same, like what you sell to everybody? Yes, the housing and its optics is completely the same because the shooting team already yeah, satisfied with its quality and its image quality, also its resolution, of course. So they, they don't have any request about optical performance. This is really a big honor when I think about this because there are so many other established lens manufacturers in the world. And I guess that was received in a very positive way, way in your headquarters to hear that they, they want to use your lenses. Do you know to which scenes they actually used those lenses? Yes, uh, we, uh, we noticed some uh, out of scenes uh, shoot on our primes. Uh, mainly uh, the talking scene uh, between uh, Penny and Tom Cruise as a maverick. Uh, Such scenes uh, contain a lot of bokeh and the smooth bokeh and a lot of nine-shaped bokeh also. So these scenes definitely should on our primes. So any of the communication technique that you put in, in those lenses evolved and came to other lenses that you are selling in those days? Yes, uh, we, after the development, we, uh, we improved its durability, its compatibility with its uh, other cameras because uh, this special lens is, uh, is made for dedicated to Sony Venice because it's Top Gun Maverick shot on Venice. So after that, we uh, expand its compatibility with other cameras and then we uh, changed the specification of our peer mount that has uh, eye technology version as. Okay, Wakamatsu-san, what can I say? It's a small, nice story, but a unique one. Anything else before I say thank you and goodbye? Yes, our, our personally, the development of these lenses is one of the toughest projects in my development history because the time was only two months because 
uh, at that time, uh, Mr. Tom Cruise uh, walked around all over the world to to marketing purpose as uh, at that time uh, Miss Mission Impossible Fallout. So, fortunately, the time was a kind of rest of shooting. So then we could get the time to develop these special lenses. Very nice, Okamatsu-san. Always a pleasure talking to you. Thank you very much for giving me the time and telling us this uh, nice story. My pleasure. Thank you. Guys, thank you very much for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.